Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ebony, and I literally fell off the face of YouTube. Um, I haven't been making YouTube videos that often, just because I kind of wanted my YouTube to go into a different direction. Um, I want to do, like, vlogs and tours and challenges and tags and things like that, and not just thrift hauls. I wanted it to be a little more broad. So I was kind of just sitting back and brainstorming, and this year, now that I have a fresh start, I know exactly what direction I want my channel to go into, so I will be posting more often, so make sure you subscribe and you click that little bell notification so, so that you're notified whenever I post a video. As you can tell by the title of this video, I'm going to be doing a thrifted room tour. Um, I haven't seen a lot of these on YouTube. Um, a lot of what's in my room is thrifted, so I don't think that I need to put the disclaimer out that there's no need to brag because there's really no need to brag. Every, just about, I would say 90% of my room is thrifted, and I just want to give you guys a tour and show you that um, secondhand stores and thrift shops are really good places to shop for decor and just things for your home, and um, right now I'm in college, so my room is kind of my dorm, so everything is kind of just in here and you'll just see how I organize everything and I hope I give you guys some ideas and if you have any suggestions on what I should add to my room because I'm always looking for ways to change up my room if you have any su suggestions you can leave them down below um, and I just hope you enjoy the video so let's get right into this room tour okay and just to get started I'm going to give you guys an overview of the room so here is my room and all of its glory. It's a pretty nice sized room, like I'm able to fit a lot of furniture and have a lot of storage for most of my things. So let's just get started on the back door where I was just standing. Um, this is clearly my door. Um, I just have like my robe and a lot of my jackets that I'm currently wearing. It's kind of, I'm in Atlanta, Georgia, so it's not cold enough to wear a heavy jacket. So I just have a lot of light jackets and kind of like windbreakers. And then up there I just have a little sticky note that says donate clothes because there's always a bag of clothes right here on top of my hamper that I forget to take with me um, when I'm going to the Goodwill to donate things. And yeah. So this hamper um, here was thrifted as well as this nightstand um, that was thrifted as well. And so I just have three little picture frames on top of my printer and this one is my cousins and I, um, my cousins, my mom and my brother and I when I was little, and that's my dad. And then coming over here, this is my desk area, and this is where I do my makeup, my editing, my, um, this is where my camera's usually set up when I'm doing a thrift haul. And I told you guys earlier, I'm a student, so my homework gets done here as well. So let me just take you on the tabletop. I'm currently burning uh, Marshmallow Fireside. Oh my goodness, that smells so amazing. It's one of my favorite um, Bath & Body Works fragrances. And then I just have a little owl from Pier 1, which was often also thrifted. I'll actually go through this whole video and just tell you guys what was thrifted. So the desk is from Ikea. Um, the chair was left here when the um, last owner moved out, so I just threw my little faux, faux fur vest over it just to you know make it match the room because it's really not that good to look at um the candle holder was thrifted and it is from Bath and Body Works but I just thrifted it it was like 99 cents so was the lamp and the mug and the flowers um so yeah and then that's just my computer and my desk and then this is what I have over here. This is just my calendar. I wanted to get something this year that was very motivational and scriptures are just something that I can look at and just reflect on. So I really like that. And then this is kind of just a board that I put together of things that make me smile. So it's just cards and things from like my students and um, pictures of my family and my great grandmother who passed away. So yes and then over here is my shoe collection I'm not really a shoe person like I'm not a shoe kind of girl so I don't own a lot of shoes it looks like a lot but it's really not because if you think about it 
you can't wear boots like my boots are down here but you can't wear boots all year long so these are like my winter shoes right here is like my summer section and then here is kind of like what I wear all throughout the year and then here's my closet we are not going to get into the closet today because girl mm, mm, mm. and then here's my mirror which was um, also left at my old house so I just brought it with me when we moved because I really like the color and it just matched so it worked and then I just keep my slippers down here um, this rug that I have on the floor was also thrifted which I love I was looking for something like this so I'm happy about it okay my bed my bed is from Ikea um, it was only it was very inexpensive it was only about like eighty dollars for the for the bed and then I just went and bought mattresses but yes my comforter is from Walmart the pillows are from the um, teal accent pillows are from Target and then this is just from Myrtle Beach so I just have that here when it gets hot too hot for the comforter but I still like something thrown over me um here is where I kind of it's kind of a nightstand kind of not I try to use it as both I was actually looking for something that would fit between my bed and this wall and this is the only thing I can find I was actually gonna put what was in front of the what was um, holding my printer I was going to use this as a nightstand but it's too wide to fit in this corner so um, yeah I'm just using this and it just has my alarm clock on there I usually have my mug because I like to drink a lot of tea um, my lamp and some lotion and what else is up there oh just some moisturizers and bio oil and then down here I just have this King Tut that has like mirror and it's just very pretty and then I have a little artificial plant down there flower I mean um over here which was oh, oh I forgot to mention sorry I forgot to mention that this was thrifted this is from Ross and that was thrifted as well and then this is just a lamp that has been in my family for a very long time I just switched out the shade it's not that pretty to look at because it just doesn't match but what I love about this mirror hold on let me show you I love that it has like different modes on it so like that part lights up or they can both light up like this so I just really like that about the lamp so that's why I have that one um okay here I just have my little bed tray I guess you can say because I don't have a nightstand and I like to have a hard surface to put things on so um, while I'm on break I've been reading books and just jotting down ideas for YouTube so up here is the book that I'm currently reading it is called Gods at War by Kyle Eidelman I strongly suggest that book it's a really good and easy read um, I have my speaker my remotes my journal um, and some Shea Souffle and my headphones and highlighters and pens of course so just jot down notes and stuff while I'm reading. Up here, these two um, pictures are from, those are thrifted. I thrifted those about a year ago. Um, they're from Z Gallery, but I got them for about $11 a piece at my local Goodwill. And moving on along, I only have one window in this room, so it does get very dark in here. This, um, these panels are from Target and they're just black with the little rosette detail on them which I think is really cute because I love anything floral and just you know nice and chic here is my jewelry armoire I did not thrift this I got this from the classyhome.com I will leave a link down below and if you guys want to see a jewelry armoire tour, tour just leave a comment down below and I will be sure to put that up um, but yeah it's just mirrored and I really like this this top part opens up and the sides open out to hang necklaces on so it does have a lot of storage and then up here I just have these two um, neck busts from where did I get those from I got those from Target so yes I actually wanted a third one but they were all sold out by the time I went and the last one there was broken so 
I'm stuck with these two because I don't see them anymore in Target. But if I do, I will be sure to link them down below. This beauty, she is from the Goodwill as well. And I just really like this because of the metallic, the mixed metal. I'm all for it. So, yes. And I'm so mad because I just painted my room and it already got nipped on the side. So, boo. Okay, and down here, this bench was also thrifted. It was about $17 from Goodwill. And I am just so in love with it. I wanted something like this in front of my bed for the longest time. So when I saw this, I just had to have it. And on top of that, I just have a plate that kind of reminds me of this picture up here. Like the kind of colors and the splash and the metals. So, um, yes, that was thrifted. And I'm burning, what is that? That is Buttercream by Yankee Candles, which smells awesome as well. I usually don't burn, I don't know why I did that today. I usually don't burn um, buttercream and marshmallow fireside together, but uh, yeah, that's what I'm doing today. Um, over here is just a, what is it, like a DVD slash game organizer. Um, I'm not a real movie person, so I just have a few up there, but they're mostly like Wii games and stuff, so. Yes. And then over here is my tea. Sorry, I just stopped recording. Okay, so over here is my TV. Um, my minimal makeup collection. I say minimal and not minimalist because people on YouTube, they go all out about people saying minimalist when it's not minimalist. But this is just minimal. I'm a start. I'm a newbie when it comes to makeup. So, yes, I'm just starting out. And then... Here is like my perfumes and lotions and just body mist and just things like that. And then here is my dresser. Which, oh, by the way, my dresser was thrifted. This was $11. It was all broken up. When I found it, I put it back together and now it's great. Also, this tray that my perfumes and, and things are on, that was thrifted as well. And so was this. And that I purchased from Ross. And this picture up here. Uh oh, there's a glare. This picture up here was thrifted. So. I love her. She's just unbothered and she's not here for it. <laughs> yes. So that was my room. I know it went by super fast. But um, I'm just going to give you guys one more overview. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And I will see you guys later. Okay guys, and that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my thrifted room tour and that you guys got some inspiration. Um, if you enjoyed it, please give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below and do not forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys later. Bye!